Economist Professor Roger Hossein is advising that focus should be placed on e-tech parks. He suggests building five new ones, then marketing and selling them abroad. The professor says this is key to our future development. Because in my understanding, this country really doesn't have as good a future as we could get unless we go into those e-tech parks. You know, those e-tech parks or the equivalent of non-energy uh, export sector diversification is extremely critical given the downward trend in our, trend in our stock of foreign exchange for us to have a reasonable, decent standard of living in the medium term that is sustainable. Professor Hosein says the small man will also see the benefits. With economic growth, as the Minister of Finance did mention, there will come opportunities for all. It would be slow because after about a 20% decline in GDP from 2015, when you see 2.5% growth, uh, that's, it, 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 it's not magnanimous, but it's something to start with. And so the trickle effect from that and the spillover effect from that would create a little job here, a little job there. He further calls for an end to the bickering and fighting, and instead, a unified approach to economic sustainability. Instead of the police policy makers coming and fight with the technocrats and wanting to quarrel, let's sit down and work together. Let's try this country needs everyone pulling in the same direction. Let's see if there is a technocrat here or a technocrat there that may have 1% value added. And let's see if that 1% value added can help the economy. Because after 20% contraction, I don't think there's room for friction. I think there's room for us to work together. Professor Roger Hosein was giving his perspective following the mid-year budget review. Nicole M. Romney, TV6 News.